Peace. This is a meat and potato sorcery production starring myself, the Water Alchemist, and today's topic for the occult family is the art of dying without dying. Now, I want to say this. We know that in the year set, there's a lot of things going on, and I want to speak to that because a lot of people are in denial about this empire that is falling. It is falling, and there's nothing that anyone can do to stop it. And the thing about it, it's the same old story historically. All empires erode and self-destruct from within. So in other words, the unseen hand or the de facto government in the shadows is purposely destroying America. So crypto is not going to save you. That's not going to save you. What you're going to have to do is you're going to have to engage in some form of spirituality and practice the art of dying without dying. Now, most people will look at that as an oxymoron, but look at it like this. I remember an old movie, Frankenstein versus the Wolfman, and Lawrence Talbert was basically removed from his grave. Or his, head, his grave was disturbed, excuse me, from some grave robbers. And I remember when they committed him to a so-called asylum because he was trying to tell everybody, you know, who he was. And they said, well, that's impossible because Lawrence Talper has been dead for four years. And then he thought about it and what he was, which was a werewolf. And he said, wait a minute, I can't die. Now, where am I going with this? Let's say you involve yourself in the occult and you become a witch or a sorcerer. Unbeknownst to you, all the things were lining up to become your fate, your destiny. So that means that when you were in a toxic relationship, you may have dabbled with a couple of witch books or grimoires or whatever, but there was something holding you back. And then what happened? You probably lost your job, didn't you? One or two of them to be exact. Or you ended up homeless. And that is the most hurtful thing in the world, to end up homeless, because that leads to the desolation of ego. You've lost everything. And those so-called family members, let me put 10 to 10. You probably lost them too, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Those so-called friends didn't call you as much. Didn't have room for you, you know, to stay at their house. Then the thoughts kick in, you know, the suicidal ones. And then you think about unaliving yourself, removing yourself from the physical plane. The only problem is there's a voice that whispers to you. Come on, family. Admit it. You can write it down in the comments. There's a voice that said, don't you do it. You can't do this. But you were so close, wasn't you? You want to know what that voice was? Either it was one of your guardian angels or your guardian demons. They wouldn't let you die. See, when you're homeless or you lost your job or you lost your house or even your marriage may have fell apart. That's part of the art of dying without dying. You were so close, but something stopped you. That was that something. And you look around America, everyone talks about the migrant situation. And it is disturbing. But again, if these migrants didn't want to be here or wouldn't want it, they wouldn't be here. That's to drive down the cost of labor. Unions been losing Jews since the 80s. Facts. And you look around. Jobs aren't plentiful like they used to be. Many people aren't going to get a pension. In other words, you have to go through the art of dying without dying, which means you have to create your own job. Create your own economic stability. Everything is set up to implode. And what's going to happen is they count on the trogs. Begging them. See, you want a new, a lot of you, Charles, you want a new master. Oh, this never would have happened if Trump was 
uh, if he was in office, the pandemic happened on his watch. Oh, y'all forgot that part, huh? Now, for the occultists, we observe, we're in it, but we're not of it. Big difference. So let this sink in. The next time that there's this voice that keeps pushing you and won't let you go, it won't let you go because not only have you not completed your mission, you have yet to even begin. Something for you to ponder. And that is the art of dying without dying. So with that, that is your meat and potato sorcery for the day. I am the Water Alchemist. You're water, my friends. Peace.